at all. Good for them. Perfect. We yeah. all love Piggly Wiggly. Well, let's talk about weather because I think people want to know. It's great that the Piggly Wiggly's opening, right? But uh, we want to know how the weather's going to shape up for this do you Saturday. Really want to know? Yes. yes, of course you do. do, do, do okay. Do. All right. You know, it's going to be kind of a mixed bag this weekend. Live look outside the Magic City. We've got clouds overhead, but we do have some breaks in the clouds. And it was a beautiful sunrise this morning. Sun was up at 5:37. Right now, it's 75 degrees. The wind is calm. It feels like 75, but later on this afternoon, the feels like or the heat index, whichever you prefer to call it, uh, will top out in the mid, upper, and some spots, lower 90s. On our storm track radar at 648, the sweep picking up some rain down around Montgomery and Praffle, but that's going to stay to our south. Here's a look at the radar in motion over the last 12 hours. And again, we've got this big, broad area of low pressure back off to our west and rotating around it are these little spokes of energy the hefty rain this morning along with storms down to our south okay so as we head through time let's check out our storm track future cast clouds and radar and what you're looking at here white is forecast cloud cover and the brighter shades of white the thicker the clouds and then the green indicates rain the darker the green the darker the forecast rain along with the temperature. So at 830 this morning, temperatures in the upper 70s. And then as we head into the afternoon hours, 130 temperatures in the low, mid and upper 80s, 87 around Pell City, 85 Birmingham, 83 Alabaster. And notice these little speckles of green. So isolated showers, maybe a pop up thunder shower as we get into the afternoon and early evening. This is around 530. So from Gadsden, down to Pell City, Birmingham, we could see a little broken line of showers and thunderstorms pop up. And if you're outdoors and you hear thunder, you're going to hear me say this a lot over the course of uh, time here, but that's your cue to take it indoors. Thunder. Not when you see the lightning, when you hear the thunder, that's when you need to go indoors. Okay, as we head into the overnight hours, the showers and storms that pop up early this evening, they'll fade pretty fast once the sun goes down. And then we're left with clouds and very muggy temperatures overnight. Tomorrow morning, a few showers around. And same setup for tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow evening, a band of showers and isolated storms. And it's going to be, you know, not a washout as we head through the weekend. But we just want you to be aware. So that's why we have a weather aware for today that the weather is going to be inconvenient at times. Temperatures this morning, upper 70s, low 80s. Later on this afternoon, mid to upper 80s, often on showers and storms. When's the weather getting nicer? Back to work Monday, wouldn't you know it. Uh, Tuesday looking good. Average high for this time of year, 86. Overnight temperatures will get back into the comfortable zone, lower 60s. And then we're back to near 90 on this upcoming Friday. All right. Like I said last time, I think I said this to you, you know what, we have a few showers this weekend, but that's okay because we're rounding out the week looking real sunny and real nice and real warm. I like the way this one thinks here. Hey, that's why we're a team, right? That's right. <laughs> All right. Well, your time right now is 651. On a more serious note, inside the shocking arrest.